Once upon a time, in a small sunlit village, there lived a boy named Mateo. He loved to listen, not to people but to the quiet things, the hum of the wind through the window, the soft creak of the floorboards, and most of all, the silence of his grandmother's old guitar. It sat in the corner of her room, gathering dust since the day she passed away. One afternoon, Mateo tiptoed in and brushed his fingers across the strings. Most were broken, but one, just one still sang. When he plucked it, a tiny golden light floated out. It shimmered like a firefly and danced in the air. Mateo's eyes widened. Abuela, he whispered. The light twirled and glowed brighter, circling him playfully, and in that glow, he could almost hear her laughter soft, warm, like the echo of a memory. He picked up the guitar. One string, two strings, three. As he tuned it, the little light pulsed with joy. When he began to play, the entire room changed. Family photos on the wall came alive, showing his grandmother smiling, twirling, clapping to the rhythm of the song she used to love. Mateo played with all his heart not perfectly, but truthfully. Each note filled the room with light, and every strum felt like a hug. I created this animated kiss story video using just some prompts. Yes, you heard me right. Now, after tons of research and testing everything out there, I have finally found a way that I can create animated kiss story without going out through the stress of editing or using multiple tools. Normally, you need a separate tool to write the scripts, generate the images, animate them, and add your voiceover. But in this video, I'll show you one single tool that does everything all in one place. With this tool, you can create any type of story you want, adventure tales, horror stories, hit animation, 3D cartoons, and so much more. Now here's the best part. It keeps your character design consistent all throughout the video, and it can create up to 30 minutes length of video. So make sure to watch to the end of this video, and I'm going to be sharing with you how you can create these amazing story videos. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Divine Kennedy, and on this channel, I share with you ways you could use to start and scale your online business, plus powerful YouTube automation tips to help you grow. And do not forget to hit the subscribe button, turn the bell notification on, so you're not going to miss up on any of my content I upload right here on YouTube. And of course, you're going to get notified whenever I upload a video right here on YouTube. Now, let's get into the video. So guys, the tool we're going to be using in this video is called Magic Light AI. And of course, on Magic Light AI, all you have to do is to input a prompt. And it's going to do everything from image generation, generating your voiceovers, putting it together, editing it, and turning it into a whole full video. Right? So in order for us to get started, all we have to do is to come over to their homepage and click on create your first story free. Now to click on that, it's going to take you to this interface and right here in the interface guys, you can see creation center. Now they have story to video, key story one click, AI video agent, image to video. So guys, for this tutorial, we're going to be using story to video. So all we have to do right now is to click on this story to video and click on create. Now as you click on create, it's going to take us to the creation page. And right on the creation page, all you have to do is to input your script right here. And of course, it's going to turn it into a full video. Now right here, guys, you can see there's a smart script and also the basic script. Now in the smart script, if you're finding it difficult to come up with an interesting story or to come up with a story in general, you can just input your idea right here in the smart script and it's going to generate a whole script for you while in the basic scripts you can come up with your own original script if you're creative like me you can go for this or the smart script any one of your choice right so the very first step when it comes to creating kids animated story you need a script so under the basic scripts guys i'm going to be heading over to chat and i'm going to use chat to write a good original script for me that actually looks good now once i'm on chat gbt i'm going to tell chat gbt write three kids animation cartoon story for me and i will choose the best because i want the varieties and see the one that i like the most and of course i'm going to be using it so chat gbt have written three animation stories that i can turn into a video so i'm going to choose the best while it's very short right here if you want a longer script you can tell chat gbt to write a longer script for you so this is a tutorial video so i'm going to be using the first one i've read through it and i think it's the most interesting one. So all I have to do right now is to copy the whole script. Now as I copy the whole script, I'm going to be heading back to Magic Light AI. Now Magic Light AI, all I have to do right now is to paste in my script. Now after pasting my script, I'm going to come over to the aspect ratio. Do I want my video to be in a landscape format or a portrait format? Now if you're creating a TikTok, YouTube short or Instagram Reels video, you want to click on the portrait. While if you're creating a YouTube video, you want to click on the landscape. And in the course of this tutorial, I'm going to click on the landscape because I want my video in the YouTube format. 
Now, once you've selected it, all I have to do right now is to come over to where I see the video language. Now, to come over to the video language, there are different languages you could use for your story. So, in this case, I'm going to be going for English. Mind you, there's Espanol, Portuguese, Indonesia, and lots more. So, let me hit on this English. Now, I'm going to scroll down and you're going to see star. Now, under this star, what quality of video are you looking to create? Now, there's 3D cute, there's realistic. Also, right here, there's 3D cartoon 2.0. There's also Disney, if you want your video to be in a Disney format or Pixar. Now, in the intro of this video, I actually used a Pixar format, right? So, let me just go for this cartoon format, this 3D cartoon 2.0. Once I click on it, all I have to do right now is to click on Next. Now, after clicking on Next, it's going to split that script into different scenes. And you can see that in this script, it split it into five scenes. And of course, one image will be generated for each scene. Alright, so all I have to do right now is to continue and click on next. Now guys, it's going to analyze the story. So it's analyzing the story to create images for the story. And of course, consistent character throughout the video. Now currently guys, it's taking us to the storyboard. And in the storyboard section, it is generating the different images for each scene. Right, you can actually check it out guys. This is the images for the scene of the video so currently still generating this one right here so i think it has generated all of them this is it you can see consistent character this on its own actually looks good imagine doing everything in one place it saves time and of course it's less stressful now after generating this character the next thing for us to do is to animate these images so it's actually going to look good so without animation it's just going to be stagnant and it's not going to give it that interesting vibe all right so in order for us to animate all we have to do right now is to click on the image now so click on the image you can see animate hit animate right here now see it animates right here you're gonna see animate one animate one simply means it's gonna animate only one image in the entire story but all you have to do is to click on animate all now once you click on animate all it's gonna animate the whole image in the story and it's gonna make everything look good right so all we have to do right now is to click on next and make sure that all our images are selected click on select all and make sure that every scene is selected then all you have to do is to click on next once you click on next all you have to do right now is start on this first one right here make sure you tap on it and you can click on confirm to animate all the scenes you can see image in animation okay so it's currently animated now while animating we want to use the perfect voiceover for our video and now can you access the voiceover here all you have to do is to come over to the left hand section you're going to see voiceover now there are different voiceover you can use for your story right here there's jack laura if you want to actually check them out you can click on the audition and you're going to hear them let's take an example you never know what you're gonna get life was like a box of chocolates you never know what you're gonna get i think i like this one better so you can try out every voice and check out the voice that you're comfortable with. So let's go for Laura. So right here guys, you can actually check it out that all the scenes have been animated and they all look good. Let's check out the second one right here. So let's just wait for it to play. So it still looks good. Now as we've gotten all the scenes animated and ready, all we have to do right now is to click on next. Now, also click on next right here so you guys can see your cover title. You can put anywhere you want for the cover. Now, you can select anywhere you want for the cover. Now, once you scroll down, guys, you're also going to see the cover title. Now, you can choose the different um, fonts you want to use for your cover title, right? So, let me go for this. I like this better. Also, guys, you can see subtitle setting. You can also choose the font you want for your subtitle. Just click on subtitle here. You can choose the font you want for your subtitles. Also, there's background music. There are different background music that you could actually apply from here. So, once you have made sure that all these settings are properly checked, then you can now click on generate to generate your video. Alright, so guys, I'm going to be choosing the ratio 16.9, still maintaining that ratio. Now, the video export resolution, I'm going to be exporting in 1080p. I'm going to click on OK. And of course, you can see we are exporting our video. Wonderful to family, the video is then exported. Now, let's watch the video we created together. Once upon a time in the big blue sky, there was a tiny cloud named Puff, who didn't like raining. 
While other clouds painted rainbows and watered flowers, Puff just floated around feeling useless. One day, he saw a sunset turning the sky into golden pink, and he had an idea he puffed up, soaked up the colors of the sunset, and painted the sky with swirls of light. All the birds and clouds gathered around in awe. From that day on, Puff didn't make rain, he made beautiful sunsets instead. And he finally realized, you don't have to do what everyone else does to make the world beautiful. Do. That is it guys, we've come to the end of this tutorial and if you got value from this tutorial, make sure to go down, smash the subscribe button, turn the bell notification on so you can notify you whenever I upload more videos just like this. So I'm going to be seeing the next video. If you have any questions, leave it down in the comment section and of course I'll do my best to reply you. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.